Hello and welcome back to the Renegade Gamers channel. I'm the Renegade Gamer and we're playing Man of Badon. Brad, Alex's brother, innocent. 8.30. French Polynesian, present day. Alex, Brad's brother, Julia's boyfriend, insecure, motivated. Think we got enough? If we run out, we can always call for backup. So, uh, look. I've never been down there before. Down? The water? Diving? Or maybe you could show me how the pros do it. Are you serious? Uh, yeah. I mean, are you serious you came out here without taking any lessons? Uh, kinda, yeah. Uh. I wanted to, I just didn't, I didn't have time, you know? I had to work all summer. Oh, uh, fair enough, fair enough. Whoa, careful. That dive cam is, like, super expensive. Look, bro, be cool. What? Julia and Conrad are, you know, how do I say it? Super fucking loaded? So? So don't sweat the little stuff, man. It's not cool. Don't make me regret letting you tag along. Dude, you know I'm not, like, the best around new people. Whatever. Oh, shut up. Brad. You're not on this trip because you're my bro. I mean, you are my brother, but I mean, like, we're buddies, you know? Um, kinda. We're just out here to fucking hang, cool out, and kick it. What the fuck are you talking about? Let's just kick it and be legends, man. <laughs> All right, amigo. Calvary's almost here. Cool. Sorry I'm a little snappy. I'm just... When you medical school would be stressful, you know? Total shocker. And man, the long distance thing with Julia... It's been rough. Uh... It's been like two weeks. Mm -hmm. Huh? <laughs> yep. Right on cue. What? Conrad doesn't think we have enough beer. Ah. I guess I keep these in an undisclosed location. Yeah. <laughs> Conrad. Fiss. Fliss? Julia, Alex, okay, benevolent, witty, innocent, arrogant, anxious, and eager. Hey, so, uh, can I get your input on something? Yeah, what? Just, uh, kind of a big thing I'm trying to make a decision about. About finishing med school? No, but it's just kind of a big life choice, you know? I don't know what's the right thing to do. Yeah. Go with your gut. If it's right, you'll know. Bearing updated. Hey! Julia! Conrad's sister, Alex's girlfriend. Reckless, excited. Conrad, Julia's brother. Relax, foolhardy. Oh, sorry. Connie, this is Alex. Hey, what's up, man? It's Conrad. <laughs> Watch it, sis. Lady killer, right here. <laughs> Good to finally meet you, Conrad. This is Brad, by the way, my little bro. Hey. <laughs> I feel like I already know you. I've heard so much about you. Yeah, uh, likewise. Miss me. Hey, man. Want to crack a cold one with me? Every second. Uh, and don't mind my hidden beer. I mean, I would have gone with minutes. Yeah, that, cool. <laughs> Tight. Uh, I, I love beer. I do too. <laughs> right on, Radical. I like the cut of your ship. It's jib. 
Don't ruin it. You ever do any diving before? Um, no, actually. Never done it before. Water virgin. Nice. Hey, we're gonna pop your cherry together. We're gonna be gentle. Uh... <laughs> really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Where's the old crust bucket skipper anyhow? Fliss, impatient, captain of the Duke of Milan, courageous. I'd invite you to make yourselves at home, but, uh... So is everybody on board and ready to go? Oh, and I'm buying. Oh. Yeah, I saw that coming. <laughs> That's it. Get it all out. Yeah. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Yeah. Oh boy. See those hot pigs. Now we're in the shoots of Alex. What about over here? That's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive cam. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Yeah. This one's different. I'm just saying, if it gets too late, I know some nice places where you can just take, you know, a nice dive. Uh, let's see. Brad did his homework. If he says a wreck's here, it's here. <sighs> okay, look, you're the client. I'm just saying we don't have unlimited daylight. I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Bliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? The right way. Come on, what is this, kindergarten? I had to bring it up. If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? Fine, as long as you're quick. And don't touch anything. Oh, I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine, untouched? <sighs> we should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll <coughs> The boy will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera, see if you can find anything useful. Righto. That was a strange cut. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro? Alright, so... I don't even know where he is. Hey. Hi, sweetie. I don't think he might be a way in. Almost got the gear good to go. Uh. So, thanks again for springing for the good stuff. Nice to be able to do it right. Uh-huh. What? You know the size of my bank account is not in a competition with the size of your penis, right? Wow. Uh. I still do good. <laughs> but... If it was a competition, I'd still do pretty good, right? Well, if you adjust for inflation, gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. See? Yeah, I know. Let's just play cool for now. Cool? Why? There's no point in antagonizing her. 
If she tries to keep me from doing this dive one more time, that's it. Gloves off. That's fair. Just don't force her hand. All right. I'm going to get these rebreathers set up, and then we'll go through the final steps together. Cool. Just holler at us when you're ready. I've never been diving, so I don't know jack shit about this stuff. Cool. All right, then. Something shining over here. What's this? Felice Du Dubra? Birthday, 180 pounds. Weight, brown. Hair color. Oh, height, 5'8". The instructor ID on the rear is authorized to conduct classes. Designated specialty as sanctioned by Dive Master Federation. Expires 12, 13. This doesn't look kosher. Okay. And what is this? Yeah. There's a little gap in the tail. Take a look. All right, what are we looking at? The ship? Or the red or the plane? A lot of pictures here. Oh, am I just cycling back through the ones we just looked at? I think so. I'll know in a second. Yeah. Okay. You know how to use that? Uh, no, not really. You might want to just let it do its thing. Is that what was shining? Hey, hey, back. Okay, I guess he's got nothing himself. All right, let's go see our brother. Wait, is that his hair or is that part of the suit? Okay, it's part of the suit. Okay. How you doing? Sorry, that brewski got the better of me. Hey, all part of the adventure. Dude, Sorry for putting a damper on things. No worries, are. dude. Took more than that just to screw up the trip. Let's get some rest. Come back when you're feeling better. Okay. Sure, Julia left anything on the mainland. Shrewd of innocence. Elsa's. This only smelled as good as it cost. At least it made her happy. Sounds like a high price. Shroud of innocence. Whoa. Well, I guess I'm not getting to look at it any more than that. All right, fine. Uh, 
anything else here? No? All right. Let's go to the diving tanks then. Unless we see something along the way. Oh, oh. What am I looking at here? Okay. I'm not sure how that's supposed to help. Okay, um... Comrade, you're in the way. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way up. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Thanks for setting me straight, looking good. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. Looking for a first mate, Captain. What am I looking at here? I fuck, I don't know. You're on camera. I'll take the wheels. Let's get a before photo. All right, kids. Good to go. Just remember the rules, please. I got the bang stick. Yeah, I heard that about you. Ha ha. You ever have to use one? On a shark? Nope. Yeah, it may have been the wrong choice. But I guess we'll find out. Hey, a souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> not like they can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. We're losing daylight here. Howdy, Captain. Looks like we're playing Fliss. You a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh and eager cabin boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Uh. Pass. I have to stay focused on your friends down there. Pretty nice ride you got here. Where'd you get the cash? It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. <sighs> That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye.
Weather looks clear. Mm. I have to keep an eye on those clouds. Uh oh, it's getting mighty crowded out here. Duke of Milan, 20 miles north of the coast, over. Reading you. How can we help? Over. Looking for a weather report in my area? Over. We've got a severe front heading into your vicinity from northwest. Thunder, lightning, 21 knot winds. Keep an eye on that. We'll check you in the AM rounds. Over. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow then. Over. <laughs> wow. That is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. All right, I guess there's nothing new there. Duke to Alex, Duke to Julia. How's it hanging? Uh, see, so you can monitor about it, take advantage of your... You look like you're taking full advantage of your relaxation time. I'm a man of many talents. Beep, bleep, bleep. It's too bad charm is not among them. Ah, but my charm is like a boomerang. You think it's gone right over your head until smack. You're out cold. That makes no sense. I have to keep track of the dive, but I'd be happy to continue this conversation later when I can give you my full attention. In private? Private? Just, just chatting it up, you and I, in the old conversational intercourse. <laughs> You're moving on a little too quick, well, hello sir. hello there, Captain. Can I do something for you? I can think of a few things. Oh, do tell. Mm, maybe later, if you stay on my good side. All right, then. Go check on, uh, what's his name? I, I forgot his name. Oh, of course, she can open it. <laughs> Her damn ship, I guess it makes sense. Why do I keep these around? Uh, I'm not even sure what the hell I saw. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. <sighs> hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. Uh, crap, I didn't mean to hit that. Hey, Fliss. 
Look, there's a boat. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? Good question. This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? Here, you see this? Look at our boat! We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. My asshole. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. You're, you're seriously not helping your case, Conrad. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. Conrad, really? Really? On the rear turret. Huh. Good on you, Connie. The turret. We can get in through there. So now we're in control of Julia. Dangerous. Uh, ladies first? <laughs> All right, then. Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? It's a dream come true. <laughs> Let's not waste any time not exploring. Go, go, go. Oh. Well, uh, that didn't look good. Is that decompression a little bit too soon? It's possible, I guess. Julia, leave it. You don't have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? Uh... Don't be such a gonad. I'll be fine. Gonad? Seriously? Am I dead? What's happening? Live a little, Edgelord. Oh, hey. Oh. 
you do something stupid down here, that's it. One chance, you get that? I know what I'm doing, okay? I don't need a lifeguard. Searching in progress. Searching area one, clear, two, clear, three, clear. This says it was a rescue plane. Launched from a U.S. base. Uh, crap. Uh, VHR search mission B-92 Sierra rescue reconnaissance plane. Take off U.S. Air Base Island destination. Texas obscured. They were on their way to help out a ship. All right. That's a bullet. Bullet holes all down the fuselage. Shell that the wrecked B 92 found and lodged in the plane. The wrecked B 92 was shut down. Okay. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Good God. Oh. What were you expecting? What were you expecting? <laughs> the body's been down here probably 50 or 60 years. Wow. What the hell happened here? In the look of things, they knew they were goners. He's holding something. Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. <laughs> what do we got here? Okay. Holy oh. fuck! I think I went my wetsuit. Yeah. Ew. Wow. Okay, jump scare. Fuck. Pilot and co pilot. Gotta be. Playing crap. I'm gonna let the waste perish. Yeah, I'm catching my breath. <laughs> Shark, not interested in us. Let's go. Hold on. Uh, oh, okay. I thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't guess. Oh, really? I know you right? can't tell because we're underwater, right? but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia. Will you marry me? Uh. I. I. Oh crap. I, Alex, I'm. I'm sorry. I. I mean, I, I. I just. I mean, we almost just died. Julia, I'm serious. Sure. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? Yes! Yes! I'll marry the shit out of you! <laughs> Alright, handsome hero. You wanna get on with our escape from the, uh, crumbling death trap? 
Cliff. This is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Damn it. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. <laughs> I don't know much about water or underwater stuff, but I do know that's a thing. Taking too long. This is torture. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now go, go. Otherwise, your lungs will. Uh, I believe it. Your lungs will collapse. Hey, what the hell is going on? What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. There was a little uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Are you paying the ocean? What's up with the other boat? What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane. And it is huge. <laughs> full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys. Can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. Get drunk as shit. <laughs> All right. Uh, hold up. This is where we're going to end the episode. When we bring it back up, uh, we'll talk to the guy here. I forgot what he called himself. Uh, conductor. No, uh, Codex guy. Whatever. We'll talk to this dude. So, till then... I'm Renegade Gamer. Y'all take it easy, and I'll catch you next time.